Hello, my friends. A common problem that we have in our aquaponics uh, uh, filter system is floating debris that uh, continues to uh, flow into the drain pipe in the filters and uh, goes on into the system and can eventually get into the sump tank. And what we need to do is block this debris that's floating and, and to, to let it settle or to uh, be able to skim it off the surface um, at your convenience and <clears throat> remove it out of the system. And uh, a system that you can use that works is what's called a, a trash guard that they use in ponds. And I have one in my pond. And there's several different types that you are used. A lot of times uh, what they do is uh, use some type of a, a screen or a mechanical uh, method of blocking the trash from going down into the uh, drain. This would be your drain right here and your water level. Um, and a lot of times they use a network of screens to block the trash. Um, the problem that you have with this <clears throat> is the debris can collect around that guard and block the water completely. So I didn't use that system. That system I thought was ineffective. What I did was used the type that has a larger uh, larger pipe that goes around. Now for the water to go into this drain pipe, the water takes this route. So none of the water from the surface is making its way into that drain pipe. The water is coming from this direction underneath that, that guard. So the guard is what's blocking all the debris, the floating debris will just uh, gather around the out, outer perimeter of that guard. Now my <clears throat> uh, drain in my system, um, it doesn't come straight down. It makes an elbow similar to this. And that is out. So what I did with this is I drilled a hole in the side of this. I'm using a two inch uh, drain line and I used a four inch guard around that. So it's, it's a very simple uh, shield that works very well. I just drilled a hole into the side, um, set about two inches down a stock that will hold that guard in its right location. And uh, let me show you real quick how I did it. The guard is made from a four inch by seven inch PVC pipe and I'm using a two inch elbow as my outflow. So I'm locating <clears throat> where I want the elbow to come into this four inch casing and I'm going to drill a uh, two inch plus hole into the side to be able to fit that elbow uh, into the guard.
I'm cutting a piece of metal coat hanger to use as a uh, support to hold this guard uh, level. Um, I'm bending ends, bending both ends of this coat hanger, and this will secure it into the guard itself. This plastic screen is what I've used to block the de floating debris, and I'll be removing that and installing the new trash guard. And I have it set at about two inches above the water surface. Thanks for watching, my friends. Bye bye.